Now that we have a garden, let's make a few accessories. Using round plastic lacing, felt, recycled paper, acrylic paint, a toothpick, recycled paperboard, craft foam, artificial spring flowers, and glue. I start by taking round plastic lacing. Cut a desired length, cut thin strips of paper, cut a thinner strip, roll the wide strip around the end of the plastic, using glue to secure the paper in place. Trim off the excess, glue and wrap the thinner piece, carefully paint the paper with a metallic gold paint to make a water hose. Cut a piece of clear plastic from packaging, brush on a clear drying glue like Mod Podge to make the illusion of water. Take a toothpick, cut a strip of recycled paper, wrap the paper around the toothpick, use glue to secure it, trim off the excess, trim the toothpick, use a nail file to sand the rough edges, cut a rectangle of paperboard, fold it in half, cut the top at a curved angle, trim the bottom, glue the end of the toothpick into the paperboard, paint it, wrap colored paper around the handle to make a hand spade. Cut a rectangle of craft foam, round off the corners, use a hole punch to make a handle to make a garden kneeling pad. Cut strips of paper, roll the paper around a plastic cap, wrap a thinner strip around the top, remove it from the cap, glue a circle of paperboard underneath, paint it with a terracotta colored paint to make empty pots. Cut and roll, felt, place it inside the pot, for soil. I can push artificial flowers between the layers of the felt to look like something is growing. Add everything to the work table from our secret garden video. And you're done. Happy crafting! Give a shout out to Monster High Random. What's up? Aww. Remember when we used to play in the water when mom was gardening? Yay! Sophie, I'm gonna get you! <laughs> <laughs> this is fun! Sisters forever! I'll turn on the water! What? No, wait! Sophie, sorry, <laughs> kind of got carried away with the moment. <laughs> uh, sisters, forever? <laughs>